Hey everybody, around here, just showing you a little bit around. This is uh, Mandurah, Western Australia. Just going out for a walk. I'm uh, flying tomorrow to Sydney. And uh, I just wanted to do a short video here to talk about sales, okay? Um, and I'll tell you something that I, I'd like to tell you about it, right? It's a very negative t topic sometimes. People, you know, frown upon sales and whatever. I'm just gonna tell you something, something that, um, you know, T. Harv Eker actually talks about that in Secrets of the Millionaire Mind, but I, I, I wholeheartedly agree with that uh, as a general thing. If you're gonna hate on sales, you're, you're never gonna have financial freedom. It's just not gonna happen. Why? Because for you to have financial freedom, you're gonna wanna love sales, okay? You're gonna wanna love sales because you're gonna need to sell people, okay? Now, um, that, that's a good thing, okay? Selling people is caring for people as well. Actually, it's primarily caring for people. So if you're not um, loving sales, you know, realize that sales is, is a two-way street, right? You gotta love sales so you can sell other people, okay? And, and make it a positive experience for them, you know? Just like when you go and, and you, um, you know, somebody wants to get something from you, you know, um, you wanna give them a positive experience, you know? Now, by you giving them a positive experience and they're getting something from you uh, as a thank you or in exchange for the positive experience, you have sold them, okay? That's not a bad thing. That's a great thing, okay? So there's nothing wrong with sales, okay? If you are going to be dating some, someone, you know, guy, girl, whatever, and you know, you're gonna be dating them and you're gonna obviously, you know, treat them well and care for them and, and and, and be a good partner and listen to their problems and help them solve it and, and, and be a good, you know, everything, good support, you know, then, then you know, they're going to want to be with you, you know, and vice versa. You've sold them and they've sold you. That's a good thing, okay? And it goes back to the same thing with money, okay? People will just exchange with you. That's just a different type of sale. It's just that you exchange money, okay? There's nothing wrong with that. So if you hate on sales... That, that's you gotta you gotta look at sales differently you gotta actually take away any negative experience you have the subject of sales and realize that that what that was was not sale that was not sales that was just someone being a schmuck or being a, a con artist or whatever it is okay that's not sales selling somebody is a very positive thing it's a caring thing it's helping somebody it's genuinely caring for them okay giving them a good product for good value okay that's what sales is okay so that that's something that you know if you don't have that viewpoint look i'm sure there's um, other people who've spoken about that you know and so on but i just wanted to kind of share my take on it because i tell you even when it comes to money aspects i i like being sold things sold to okay i i love when people want to give me some service some product and i i watch it and i i am curious to see how they're gonna do it you know and on, on first impression it's always easy to tell are they just being pushy are they really interested in helping me? Is it just like, what's the deal there, you know? And, and you know, it's, it's actually very, very good to be able to be totally cool, to be sold to, you know, and be totally open for it. Because I tell you, it's gonna flow both ways, okay? And I tell you, I have, I, I, when, I, when I sell mob to people, I, I really don't sell them in the way that you might be looking at sales as sales. I don't push them. I don't tell them to have to do it. I don't tell them to pull out their credit card. I, I rarely even collect a credit card. They, they do it on their own Steam. They get a link. They can choose if they want to pay. Very blasé. Very like, look, it's over to you, mate. But um, obviously, I'll do everything I can to service them and so on because I generally want them to do well. And honestly, I wouldn't you know, give somebody a, an option to pay if I didn't think they would do well in the business either. So, you know, I think you just got to be very genuine about it and, and realize that the only times you'd have a distaste about it is because you haven't been genuine about it or someone hasn't been genuine about it and that the subject itself is actually a positive thing. So uh, there you go. That's my little um, motivational speech here about the subject of sales, that, that dirty, dirty word. It's not a dirty word at all, actually. It's, uh, you know, what, what drives economy, what... Um, makes the world go around in a positive way. You know, there's sales happening everywhere, you know? You wanna get your kids to school, you, you sometimes you have to sell them, you know? So uh, on, on why school's good, if you think it's good or uh, whatever, bad example. I'll choose a different example next time, but you get the idea, everything is sales. So uh, get good at it, understand what it really means and uh, make good use of it in life. Okay, bye.